In 2022, we brought you hashtag build with AES, a ServiceNow challenge where over 170 people took a crack at the brand new App Engine Studio. In 2023, we came back with hashtag build with RPA, where over 340 brave souls dove headfirst into the realm of robotic process automation. Now it's 2024, time for hashtag build with Creator Studio. My name is Lauren McManaman. I am a nine year member of the ServiceNow community and your developer advocate of the day. Here to explain exactly what hashtag build with Creator Studio is and exactly how you can participate. And with that, let's get started. Before we dive into the challenge itself, let's answer the obvious question. What is Creator Studio? <laughs> As you probably already know, on ServiceNow, there are a ton of places to build a custom application. For old timers like me, you might frequent the traditional Studio IDE, which was ServiceNow's first consolidated development environment for custom apps, which came out back in Geneva. If you're a low coder or have started developing more recently, App Engine Studio might be your pick, which abstracted a lot of the complexity away from development in lieu of wizard style of designers. And this came out in the Quebec version. Then again, if today happens to be your very first First day developing on ServiceNow, you are probably overwhelmed with the news of the newly recreated Developer Studio debuting in Xanadu later this year. Lots of tools, lots of choices, but nothing necessarily targeting no coders. People with little to no technical background, but a wealth of business acumen that could be turned into applications in the right environment. Hence, the creation of Creator Studio, it is here to serve that need. Creator Studio is the most guardrailed development environment that ServiceNow offers, walking users through the necessary steps to create service request style applications, what we have found to be by far the most common reason for creating custom apps anyway. Quick side note, there are more experiences being targeted in the future. Instead of having to learn about tables and users and ACLs and automation, all of that is taken care of in Creator Studio, allowing creators the ability to spend a lot more intimate time on formatting the forms per the business requirements. Now this might be targeting no coders, but don't think that this doesn't hold tremendous value for pro coders and low coders as well. A lot of these service request style applications bog down backlogs heavily. So by having Creator Studio, this frees pro coders up substantially, either by allowing them to knock out these apps no problem, quick and easy, or by delegating them to other people altogether. It is a win-win for both technical levels. On top of that, every single thing built in Creator Studio is bi-directionally compatible with every other development environment on the platform, allowing all types of developers to easily collaborate with one another. Now, this is just a rapid fire overview. If you'd like a much more detailed explanation of Creator Studio, as well as some more visuals on what it looks like to build in that environment, be sure to check out this video linked here and also down below in the description. Now onto the fun part, the hashtag build with Creator Studio challenge. The rules, like every year, are pretty simple as there are only three. First and foremost, you need to build an app on Creator Studio, you know, like the name of the challenge implies. <laughs> now you can do this on any instance of ServiceNow, but we highly encourage you to leverage one of the personal developer instances or PDIs for this challenge. And this is for a couple of reasons. One, Creator Studio is a very new feature existing only on the Washington and Xanadu releases. If your company instances aren't currently upgraded to either one of those, it would limit you from participating in the challenge and we want everyone to easily participate. Two, PDIs allow developers to move around a lot more freely, not having to worry about messing up corporate assets or having the right or wrong permissions to access things like Creator Studio. Now, if you're new to using a PDI or currently do not have one, I will provide some links down below how to access those and also how to leverage them. Newly acquired PDIs with the Xanadu release come with Creator Studio preloaded directly on the homepage. If you are currently using a Washington release version of a PDI, however, you will need to turn on a specific plugin to ensure that you have access to Creator Studio. I will also link those instructions down below as well. Like I said before, Creator Studio is only available in Washington and Xanadu. So if you are not currently running that version of ServiceNow, you cannot currently use 
Creator Studio, so be sure to upgrade. All right, finally, on to the second part. <laughs> After successfully building your app in Creator Studio, the second thing you need to do is share your experience in doing so. Whether that's on X, LinkedIn, YouTube, what have you. We wanna hear about the app you built, we wanna hear about the use case and your experience in using this brand new tool. Format-wise, you can do this in a couple of ways. We encourage you to create either a video, a infographic, or a 300 word or more content piece. So. Get creative with it. And, and this is very critical, so do not forget, be sure to hashtag your submissions on social media with hashtag build with creator studio. The last thing you need to do is copy the link to the social media post that you created and add it as a comment to the ServiceNow community blog post for this challenge which is also linked below in the description. Honestly, this might be the most important step as this is how we are tracking all of the participants to make sure that you can be rewarded appropriately. No community comment, no prize. Oh, did I not mention that yet? If you complete all three of these steps from September 9th to October 8th, 2024, you'll be walking away with two cool things. Those who complete hashtag build with creator studio will not only be awarded a special community badge displayed on their profile, but also will receive a special mug showcasing the flashy new theme that we developed for CreatorCon 2024. So in a rapid fire summary, build a creator studio app on a PDI. Post about it on social media using the hashtag build with creator studio and link to said social post on the community blog in the comments all between September 9th and October 8th, 2024 to receive your limited edition community badge and creator mug. Now there is a frequently asked questions section in that blog post, which I highly encourage you to check out. But if you have any questions, the best place to ask them is the newly created build with channel on the SN Dev Slack channel. You can also always email us at buildwith at servicenow.com, but keep in mind, we are a very small but mighty team. You will definitely get a quicker response by crowdsourcing it on the Slack channel. We are so phenomenally excited to see what you build using Creator Studio and learn about your experience using the tool. If you have found this video helpful or if you, at bare minimum you're excited about hashtag build with Creator Studio, be sure to give us a like down below. And if you're interested in getting more content from the developer advocates of ServiceNow, please go ahead and click subscribe as well. Thank you so much for watching this. Thank you for your participation. And as always, stay hungry, stay humble, and I'll see y'all next time. Cheers.